I'm not a Coventry person, I wasn't born in Coventry. And I knew all about Coventry City because of, of Jimmy Hill. For us, he was always that man who was a pioneer. Jimmy Hill arrived and it's, um, it's down to him, really. J Jimmy Hill is what sort of put um, Coventry as a football club on the map. Jimmy Hill means a huge amount. He's the man who led the revolution in the 60s, which took the club up to the first division. And without him, it could be argued that none of it is possible. But he was tremendous. He, he was one of the lads till the match day. He used to get onto centre forwards. I used to worry about him because he was the centre forward. And then he'd say, get out there, get stuck here. People have gone on and on and on about how he changed football. And he changed everything in football. Made the three points for a win two, and one for a draw. With the soul that he brought in and changing the, the, the colour of the kit. And... Uh, he came down on his horse one day and rode around the pitch. People tell me now the days when you know they, they called out for a linesman and, and Jimmy, who was manager of the team, uh, you know he went out and, and did the line. And you just think, well, that just wouldn't happen these days. He, he wanted to make the city and Warwickshire, the surrounding area, a family thing. And he made Coventry City the focal point of that. I can remember now, and it's what a lot of people remember, with Jimmy Hill's Pop and Crisp evenings where we used to go, all the young fans used to go. We used to sign all the uh, autographs, Chris sandwiches. It was all about making it a family experience that they could come along and enjoy it to the, you know, the same as anybody else, no matter what background you're from or not. He made it accessible. It wasn't just on match days because he used to be out, well out into the community through the week. Jimmy Hill used to live down the road from where I grew up. So, see him on TV, then go and knock on his door, told him we wanted to play for Coventry City. He held us in conversation, which at the time appeared to be ages, but most probably was only about five minutes. And every fan is so proud of the history of Coventry City Football Club. They can connect with the players, the memories, the stadiums, the games. And for this Legacy Fund to be part of that, and that connection with the history is fantastic. Jimmy Hill Legacy Fund came about uh, after the memorial service that was held at Coventry Cathedral to commemorate Jimmy Hill's life. The history behind it is on the values of a, of a key figure in Coventry City Football Club's history and uh, you know, what better way to uh, have an impact on other people's lives. There's going to be a number of ways that people benefit from the, the funding, so uh, some of it will go towards supporting activity for underprivileged children. Whether it's a family zone on a match day, disadvantaged children, adults with disabilities, children with disabilities, they can all benefit from this fantastic project. There will also be a small grant pot that local community groups and not-for-profit groups can apply to uh, to help them um, fund their voluntary activities. With crowdfunding, every single fan can feel like they're part of the impact that the Legacy Fund can have. It, it, it just makes it all open to everybody that wants to be a part of the football club. We want Sky Blues and community to be something that Coventry City fans are proud of. And the more money we can raise with the bloke and his memory is, is, is exceptional. Yeah. We as Sky Blues and community can increase the amount of work that we do in the local community and we can positively impact on more people's lives. Jimmy Hill was all about community. The more you try and understand about his legacy, the more you realise how important this legacy fund will be. And if we can impart that to our now six, seven, eight, nine, ten, whatever age group, to make them understand where it all come from, I think more people will fully appreciate what Jimmy Hill meant. Jimmy Hill meant a huge amount to every single Coventry City fan and the people of Coventry and Warwickshire. And for us all to be able to contribute to his legacy continuing for generations to come is a fantastic thing that we can all be part of. You don't have to be a Coventry City supporter to know who Jimmy Hill was. So yeah, I think it's a brilliant idea. So I advise you to do your bit. Do your bit for the Jimmy Hill. The Jimmy Hill. Jimmy Hill Legacy Fund. Do your bit for the Jimmy Hill Legacy Fund.